Hello community. Ha continuăm cu povestea principală. Running man, om fugitiv. After that night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. So where to? St. Michael's Church, directly. Careful, please. I always drive careful. Then you'd be the first. Nope. Slow down. You'll have us killed. Drift. The right. For heaven's sake, drive on the right. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. Mm -hmm. Slow down! <laughs> You'll have us killed! Stop this car at once! I'll walk the rest of the way! Can't drive without the radio. Better find a new fare. Just outside the hotel. Oh, the fuck? Thank you. Not a problem, sir. Sorry, sir. Europa. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. It's just talking. I'm paying you to drive, so do that. Look at him out there. The problem with this downtown is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Sold up before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? Have a business meeting there with a colleague. <laughs> Pull up in front of the gallery. Thanks, pal. Here's 50 cents. I'll spend it all at once. I'll try not to. Every fan today has been a son of a bitch. On to the next. Hey! 
Since five, what's your excuse? Smooth. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any good fares? Ai, cara, isso é quando for aqui, isso é quando for costa. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some, but never enough of them. Yeah. Who's got the money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Cops see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, yeah, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. <clears throat> this city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. <laughs> Nearly there. He's up here on, on the corner, please. Hey, my cousin has a coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucio sent you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. Might just do that. Ah, but I'm still drinking coffee. Stop me, babe. I'm cafe. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Hey, how you doing, pal? You know what I mean? Yeah? Huh? Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help and sell Gary's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Fuck so you, dude. Like <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Sick Fuji. No! Cigar Mishuna. Look at this. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou. You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. Well, this is the Don's favorite driver. So anything you got to say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Maybe they know. Okay, then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. Thanks. 
least we could do. Come on, let's go say hi to the Don. Don Salieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. Salieri's restaurant. Let's go! The back streets of Little Italy. Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him on the kind of time he helped us. This, uh, taxi. That's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm going to set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab in this fixed up. I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar of yours. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. Go so smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next. No return back. No one else knows you here, so tread careful. Okay? Sure. Just in case you want to jump to any part of this video. And along with the timestamps, I'm going to have a short description about that collector. For each one. Now, this is going to be part one of my collector. Okay, I'm a collectible in Zok. Let's go, family history. Take it of mini first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. We make sure we're well here for when he's done. What's he do? We'll see him whenever we need to do any heavy lifting. Make sure we're well here for when he's done. We gotta go. I'll try and back up. If the Don wants to do this again, we can meet him. Okay. Polly, he with you? Yep. Okay. If the Don wants to do this again, we can meet out of town. Some place there's no That'd be good. Yeah, that'd be good. Let's go. Pulp Fiction. Find the pulp magazine. When you sue, sue, don't, don't talk. Good to meet you. Todd, what is the 
Let's go. Oh, she's gonna sing. <laughs> Who's this then? Benny. This here's Tommy and We're doing a little job together. All right, you're good. good. Hey. You just need bean shooters or ruts? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This class thing should do the trick. <laughs> if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Aye, aye, aye. Careful with them, no. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Todd. Let me know if Polly gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. Let's go. If the boys don't scare you away, I'll fix you with a gat. Ralphie's in the garage. He's a special kind of idiot, but he's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets into the car. I'm telling you, it's like it's like a black magic. Hey, genius! <laughs> You can't, you, can't, you, can't, you can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Robbie. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a little limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> we ain't nothing alike. You got that, Ralph? Sure, 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 Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy is Tommy. Good to meet you. Like I said. Ralphie here's a crack, crack, crack dick. Well, you bring, you him, a bring him a stolen car. car. <laughs> and <make yours. laughs> Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Papa Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha ha ha, Brad, but it, it'll get you across the different town. All right, let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> One day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. I don't know what Ralph's trying to pull giving us this motor. I wanna show you something about the good life and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. You don't have to be nice about it. Stick's a tin cab! So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. Yeah. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first yeah, drop-off. Drop off. And the cops the know cops better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you got a torch, he's got more friends in the forest than us. But we're okay. As long as we're careful. Keep an eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through, you want a bottle? Just ask. Keep some back for friends. Uh, Let's go! The motor can move, Richie. 15 meter while driving a Boltes. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind. What's the least in free long kind of film? You could have this in a lot of stuff. That's good, Eddie. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. Hey, it's their cars we're wrecking today, not this junker. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. Ah! They got in these places. There's tables, there's food, there's skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wreck. They're still on us! Cars pursuit is called off. Abandoned. 
Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble? Guy, careful. We don't need the attention. Why is that bugger that colo? The guy is about to set fire to Morello's parking lot. I got that back. Oh, tak nampak saya untuk full, untuk full. Baik tanya kata. Hit the master. Go about your day. What a Let's go. Lime pockets. Pay a fine to Los Have a police department. You have to then see how to visit this smart fee. Oh, police police station. That bro, boy, I was wrong. I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine... Hey, it's their cars we're wrecking today, not this junker. Well, if it don't well, go it fine, does you why not to let them see your face? Either that, or you hit them so hard they don't remember it. We're getting on to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between... Geez, watch the road! Scusi! There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri streets. Okay, it's close by. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. Morello's goons smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. There's some lazy bastards. Put some gorilla on car, dude, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. And a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? See if you get shot. Sure. 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 Ah, boss can boss any of you guys in the city real pissed. Excellent, sir. I get the money on time. Ah, he's good for it. Tem dar um bate e dar um exo costa tem. Oh, 
Some street cops, for sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. Yep. <coughs> How did it feel? Feel good? Like what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Drive careful. We don't need the attention. Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it is. No time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. Jeez, watch the road! Think it's for you? Let's lose the cops! Life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. Busy days, it's slow days. I've had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, Knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, drive careful, we don't need the attention. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I sent you out with. Dumped it. Why? It was a boiler. This one's better. A better car with a broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. Still with you then. So, yeah. Hey, boss. No. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See, that's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morella is a hothead, and all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got a point. 
got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after me. You understand? Yes, Mr. Sillier. Then I'm going to only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys. In this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me, you're going to be living the high life now. You abuse my trust. Don Celier, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay, then. Welcome to the family. Yes, sir. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's see. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook, but his daughter Sarah, Maron. Silenzio, come facci a parte in famiglia. The way the city works, complimo a lot of party. Chapter complimo a lot of party. Those first days in Celieri's bar were slow. I moved, I moved crates, crates and delivered messages. messages. The guys the busted, guy busted balls and told stories, told stories from the old country. country. Mostly, Mostly we just waited. Just waited. I, got I got to thinking. Think maybe life in Ciliary's crew school wasn't going to get me clipped. Get me clipped. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do? You Tommy? Yeah. Boss yeah. yeah. is waiting for you. Thanks. Thanks. There he is. There he is. Sorry, I'm Sorry, late. Take a, Take a seat. That's collection, That's collection day, boys. Day. So, Tommy, you'll drive. Paulie and Sam can handle the rest. It'll be routine. Just a handful of stuff, stuff today. today. Bill at the Bill motel was a little short last night. Last. We'll make sure he pays us the interest he owes. No problem. Don't lay hands on anyone unless there's no other choice. Our clients need to understand that we provide without the service. They need to look at you and see Santa Michael. They need to believe the protector. So let Morello stoop to breaking rights. We're better than that. But the bills still do, and everyone pays up. We can handle it. Go see Ralphie about a car. Okay, boss. Okay, boss. Now, Vinny said to say he's got something for you, Tom. Head to him first. Probably just wants to tell you some bullshit story about some guy who died 20 years ago. Hey, just the guy. I saw this. And I thought of you. Shot him at the fair a couple of times. Right, right. 
Down it come. Pointed at the target over there. Good posture, real mean. Now, bang. Brain all falls. Okay? Don't show me a real one. Alright, open the chamber and away you go. Alright. Last thing needs to be hidden. Stick it in your belt. Good to go. And when shooting starts, get behind something. And don't shit yourself. Thanks, Vincenzo. I appreciate it. Hey, the Frank of the boss is gentle. To you. Not a man of moron. You guys need to be careful today, okay? I spoke to Biff, he said Morello's still bent since he lost the trust. You, you, you know how to get, get, get into one of these, I mean? Elbow goes through, through. reach inside. inside. Easy. Easy. And then after knowing to fix the fix window, window back up. Watch. Watch. And... Water. You're a regular You're a magician, magician Ralphie. Ralphie. Mm. Come on, Come on Tom. Yeah. Show me Show what you can do. Okay, oh, oh. it's good car. Oh. You got it. Have a good day, little fellas. Oh. First we got Al. He runs the bakery on Longwood Street. You know it? Yeah, I know it. Al's late again? Seems so. Eh, that's too bad. Okay, okay, this is this it. Is it. Uh, Watch what uh, we do today, Tom. When it goes when smooth, it goes it's, smooth a it's a breeze. When they put, when up, they a put fight, up a fight, sometimes, sometimes you gotta think on your feet. feet. Sure. sure, just follow my lead. No. Sam, Sam. Polly, how, how are you? We're good. We're good. How's little, little Julia? Ha. So little, so little now, little she's, she's turning, turning into a pain, pain in the ass, ass just like her grandma. Like grandma. Uh, to here. Yeah. Now. 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 Now he's got any trouble around here? Any punks causing problems? No? No? Nothing like that. Good. So you got the money? I got it for waiting in the back room. Oh, Tommy will get it. You stay here where we can see you. It's been real slow this morning, Sam. I was worried that we don't have enough. Ow. I know, I know you'd never, never hold out, hold out. but it's but good it's you good were. Work. I mean, how can we protect you, Where's the money? Error, fetch it! Voi ci succhiate il sangue! It's on the table, brown envelope! Via di qui! Lasciateci in pace! I got it. See you next month, Al. Let us know if you need anything. Anything, Anything at, all. at all. Sure will, sure will sir. Sure will. Sure will. And you're our best you're mom. Huh? Next up, we got, we got old Eugene. Eugene. I'll, cover, I'll this cover this one, one Sam. Sam. You, sure? you sure? Sure, I'm sure. sure. I'm fine, I'm fine. Alone. Just fine. I don't miss 
He's doing the store on his own. Yeah, when Polly's built up a little steam and he's to let it out on his own. She gotta let him get on with it. It's his way. You can hear it in his voice. Gotta let him lone wolf from time to time. Keeps him happy. Yeah, Eugene's nephew ain't having much fun right now. When he's going, Polly don't stop. Once we were putting a squeeze on his tailor over in Holbrook, the guy ended up in a wheelchair. Here he comes. He's a fast worker. Drive before. Nu fun eu cu masul cu mergaiți, adică mă pun până în pădure. Și no. Oh! Adică uitați-vă până unde. Aici e mama naibii. Wait for us here, Tom. We'll be back in a bit. Okay. This place is ours. Capish? And don't come back, or you'll end up in worse shape than your friends. They're trying to get information out. I gotta get you to a doctor. I can wait. Get Sam out of there. Okay. Okay, just hang on. Nu l-ai cover că nu mai știu. Asta l-ai, da.
my sights. <laughs> Oh, quack, era un spate. Nu fel motor, nu fel motor. Ia o să te ajut de pariu să mă asinat, vă să explic de ce. Deci au stelt, aproape tot ce iau stelt. Ia o să te ajut de pariu să mă asinat. You see where he went? The guy's still around here. Maybe he's over there. Așa, si gata, de zic tu. Așa, e pe tine. Go back to being a nobody. 
Ok, con Gangs of Lost Haven, con Pit Ordinary Routine. Ok, Intermission, la altura es Intermezzo. So that's how a regular Paluca goes from cabby to mob enforcer overnight. Just dumb luck. Didn't feel that way at the time. Me parking on that particular street, taking a break just when Paul and Sam are coming around the corner, what are the odds? I felt like, I don't know, like someone was watching out for <laughs> Whatever helps you sleep at night, pal, but it's a lucky break all the same. I mean, one day he'll bust in your back, burning on his day's work in a city that's been trying to scrape you off the teal since the day you stepped off the boat, and the next you're stuffing your pockets for a Salieri's dirty money, and lording it over the rest of us. Yeah, it wasn't like that. Back then, Salieri didn't have the run of the city. For every buck Salieri made, Don Morello would turn ten. He paid off cops, politicians, judges, and anyone he couldn't buy. He scared him to look in the other way. He did seem to have the city to open its own shadow, I'll give you that. You hear anything about Joey Crackers? Yeah, got his name in the Morello file, sure. Boxer, right? Yeah. That's the guy. The way I hear it, Joey was just driving to the gym one morning. Probably daydreaming about one of the belt or something. God damn it! Moron! You're driving with your goddamn eyes closed! Look at this! Jesus Christ! Don Morello! Tom Morello, I didn't know it was you. You know anybody else driving a rare import in this part of town, Joe? No. Well then, uh, I'm sorry, sorry. I, uh, I was driving real slow. You're saying this is my fault? No, 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 no sir. Like, I just, I just, I, I ain't never been in no accident. Well, repairs are gonna be expensive. Oh, you, you're not gonna need that, sir. The tires are just fine. The grills look bent up, is all. I mean, I got a cousin, I got a Da! Da una. Quai da una! In strad, fucking sea. Or should it be quite funny to put this one? I'm not even going to put that. Someone spun your tail, pal. You got the informant right there, says Merle made a mint every time crackers went to the mass. That's true, too. And still, Morello left that poor Seth dead in the street. Head all caved in. On Don Square. Well, maybe the Don knew Joey's career was on the down. Well, maybe he was trying to scare someone or someone to up. Who knows? Don Salieri jumped it up to Morello not being able to think straight when he was mad. You, uh, hmm. have any more run-ins with Morello's crew back then? Not first. For a couple of years after I joined them, things were quiet. We got into a few dust-ups with guys trying to muscle in, but now swear it was just the usual routine. We're running bulls, out for protection, me and the boys don't allow us to collect small time. But, I ain't gonna lie. Most days, we was also having a bit of fun. Fair play. Ah, well, you still mission us, da. Mission us, da. Pentru că am făcut o cotată de la stocutor cu asimilator. E una dintre cele mai oribile, scrile misiuni. E cu eu cu cursa misiunea. Mikey Dunn. That's the guy. He's a good kid, but a bit of a scrapper. Not too smart with money. A few years ago, Mikey comes to me asking for a loan. He wants to get new tires so he can keep racing junkers out of the quarry. I like fast cars, I figured it'll be a bit of a hobby. Turns out, Mikey's a great investment. The kid can't lose a race if he walks the track. He graduates from the Junkers to Cow Jobs, and I start placing a few bets on him here and there. Next thing I know, I've made all my money back and more. Hey, uh, Sam says he's the guy to beat. He was. 
We ran all the competition out of town. But now Ralph says there's a hotshot European entering the race. And he's got a car faster than our boys by a country mile. How much do we stand to lose? A truck. Load. But not just our outfit. A lot of guys from the neighborhood come to me for financial advice. They've all put money down on this kid. It'll be like Black Thursday around here if he loses. Well, for everyone except for Rob. Oh, you think he's from the European? Oh, I'm certain of it. You want something to happen to the driver? Can't find him. merle has got him holed up somewhere safe. Besides, if he drops out or disappears now, none of our wagers are safe. Everyone will cry foul for the race. What about his car? That's the ticket, Tommy. Ralph knows a guard at the track. You go down there tonight, you boost the European's car, bring it to one of our mechanics and make a few adjustments to bring the car back. Should be no problem, boss. Can I get a drink here? As soon as you're ready. Sure thing. Oh, it's time for to shoot the boys. Bring up the cushion. That's what it is. Boy, Papa.